Rogers, how are you doing? Welcome to, oh, look, it's Nick, look at this. Totally thrown me off track, which is a good thing though, because in this video, I want to talk about how to interview people, why the importance of sound is important. That makes no sense. And sound, importance and sound. And that, and yeah. those things. Um, and also, if you just happen to be out and about, and an actual celebrity oh. rocks up, nicknaming you, how you interview them in a noisy environment. Now the problem is, is obviously we're outside, it's pretty quiet here, you can hear what's going on. If only we had a noisy environment to use as an example. I have an idea. What? Since we're at, Vid <laughs> since we're at VidCon, why, I, we might be able to find a noisy environment here. Mind blown. Shall we? Shall we? Let's do it. It'll be fine. Okay. Hey, so now we're inside. Look at this. Through the magic of um, walking. Yeah, the yeah. magic of walking. The magic of walking. Going through doors. Yeah, and, yeah. The, and the transition through the power of legs. We're now inside. <laughs> but as you can hear, the audio is garbage. You've got loud voices, you've got background heaven. What? Yeah. What? Like celebrities, they just take over. You know? So, so now we're going to switch to a good microphone. Hey! So now we are using a, this is a, an interview microphone. It's a, it's a tight condenser with a short pickup pattern. And look, or listen, just how clearly you can hear the audio. You can, you're aware of background noise, but now you can clearly hear us. I mean, look how well Nick can hear me. I can hear you fantastically right now coming through this microphone. This is amazing. It's the, through the magic of technology. I couldn't even hear you a second ago. Yeah, and now we can just chat. This is amazing. I know. I say, wow. Technology at its finest at its right finest. now. <laughs> but look, on a serious note, yeah. we're here right now. I say serious. There's not much serious going on. Eh, I'm, I'm literally fanning out because I'm doing a collab video with Nick Nimmin. So, you know, this is going to be really ropey in terms of call to action and everything because <laughs> Nick Nimmin. However, to prove, to illustrate the point, it's loud here, right? Yeah. I mean, it is banging loud. Yeah, it's extremely loud. I'm not sure if you can hear that or not, but right now there's like an entire area where a bunch of little girls are screaming for whatever reason, probably like one of their celebrity fans walk by or their celebrity people walk by yeah. and they're completely freaking out. So in addition to the kids screaming, you also have a lot of music going on and all these different booths and it's extremely loud. So because of that, it's really important to get a microphone like this. I'm sure you'll have links to this in the description. Yeah, absolutely. Well. But it's really important to have a, a microphone like this so that you can really focus in more on the voice itself instead of having all of that background noise. And in addition to that, you also have the side of copyright. We've chosen this spot specifically so the noise will be audible. It'll be good for demonstration, but we're not going to get a copyright strike. Yeah, because a lot of people don't know this, but if you're walking around an event like this and they're playing a song that ha that is copyright protected, which almost all songs are, then in that situation, you can actually get your video taken down or get a copyright strike on your channel because that music is playing on the background. So if you're using something like this, this also reduces your chances of something like that happening. So this ties in perfectly with the video we just recorded. Yeah. When we're talking about what equipment to use and what microphones to use. Right now we're at the show and there are people walking around with a shotgun mic yeah. on their camera. They're not going to get any useful footage and that's yeah. kind of heartbreaking because there is so much content being yeah. created right now yeah. and most of it is going to be binned yeah. or it's going to get them copyright strikes or it's just not going to work. So yeah. when you're coming out to a show and even though I will preach go for the minimum you need, sometimes like in an environment like this, you need something a bit more specialist yeah. to get the job done. This is where you can't use generic equipment like your phone microphone or your basic shotgun. You're going to need something a little more specialist. So I hope this is a good example. Fantastic example, for sure. Well, there you go. Thank you so much for coming on and demonstrating the power of walking. Yeah, my and, pleasure. And the power of random celebrities and the power of VidCon. And if you want to see uh, uh, the collab that we did together on my channel, definitely she's going to put a link down in the description as well. So definitely head over to my channel and see the collaboration that we did on my channel as well where, Absolutely. She, where she teaches you about um, different aspects of the gear that, that you need for your YouTube channel and things to look for if you're considering buying equipment. And also, you know I said about community and how you need to like get involved with the, with the big hitters? Here's your guy. Here's your guy right here, Nick Nimmin. If you're trying to create content and you're trying to learn YouTube and you're trying to learn how to create videos online and you're not subscribed to Nick, you're just doing it wrong. Go home. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was useful. I'll catch you in the very next video. Bye.